President Muhammad Buhari has admitted that his old age is affecting his job and his efficiency in administration. Buhari, who clocked 79 on December 17, 2021, said this while reacting to a question during an interview on NTA on Thursday. Hmm. His age? He said, about my age, I see my colleagues. They are now resting, and I assure you that I look forward to the next 17 months when I, I too will be less busy, he said. The age is telling on me, working now for six, seven to eight hours per day in the office is no joke. There are questions of executive council, memos from as many states as possible to, the, to be considered virtually every week. Really, it is lots of hard work, but as I've said, I ask for it and I cannot complain. I have been a governor, I have been a minister, and I'm in my second term as president. So I've gone through all the system, and really, what else can I do for this country? I have given my best, he said. Sarah reporters add on Wednesday reported how Buhari ravaged by dementia fumbled for words when he wanted to recall the names of two governors who visited him at the Asu Rock Villa in Abuja over the farmers' headers clashes in their state. In an interview on Channel TV on Wednesday monitored by Sarah reporters, Buari had been asked whether he would support state police and regional efforts, which efforts such as Amotegu and Ebubagu to stem the tide of clashes and insecurity in the country. He has said, we have to revert to that system for us to have an effective security in the localities. For example, there were two governors that came to see me about the problem. The governors of uh, 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 Oyo State and the governor of uh, 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 this other LK in Undo, not Undo, one other state. I said because the headers were in the forest, let them go and talk to the local leadership while there is break in communication. The route they follow, the forest they confine themselves in. Sarah reporters had done several reports about how Buhari's dementia affects his performance in the government and slows down the decision-making process. Sarah reporters in May 2021 reported that Buhari's worsening dementia and other undisclosed health challenges were taking their toll on his ability to effectively coordinate meetings. The president had faltered during a meeting with the security chiefs during that week. Dementia is a general term for loss of memory, language, and thinking abilities, a condition which may be caused by the president's old age or an undisclosed medical condition okay if you want to talk about it okay dementia is general um term for loss of memory and language language and thinking abilities i could remember yes that means he really has this dementia because i could remember lai muhammad said one time when he came back from one of his trips when he stayed long when he came back oh they said he, he could not even speak his uh, Fufu did language again because of uh, the sickness he went through. So this is a confirmation of uh, what uh, Lai Mohammed said as at uh, that time. That was what he said, that he could not even speak his language, that the sickness has, has affected his, his uh, him being able to speak his language, which is uh, what we are hearing now. Well, if you know that you are whole, then resign, please, and save everybody the impact of your statement because it is reflecting on all sides of the country. You see why people talk about a uh, uh, old age and what have you. Some people will tell you that uh, it does not matter. But now he's confirming it. He's confirming it that the old age is really a, a big deal for him. And this is not the first time he said it. He said it sometime, I think uh, maybe 2018 or so, that uh, at he, uh, how he wished he was still young. But now he's still saying it. It's affecting him. But we are always patching things. And a lot of people who are very, very close to him who are saying that it does not matter. They know quite already that the problem this man is facing. But they are just trying to to, to, to cover up. And that is the reason why you see that he does not come out to, to speak with the people. Because they are hiding some things. Well, after causing a whole lot of damages to our dear country, you are now trying to justify your incompetences. Hmm. Too late for us. For this, we are ready backward. 
that is all we have been saying. Even Tinubu that is all to be resting and enjoying is scattering wet by now. Still not in ambition of becoming Nigeria president come next election. Why is African Africans, why are they so greedy? Say Baba is telling us that he wants to run away from office, that age is so disturbing him as well. You force yourself to be a president. Mommy Gio said, if you don't accept more year in the office, you are going to you are going straight away. <laughs> Mommy Gio. Okay, we'll go home and rest, Mr. President. Who told you not to rest? Who if, who forced you? We even like you resign to resign now so that you will be able to rest perfectly well. And you refuse to join them and have a rest. To join your colleague to have a rest. Your loss of power is what we bring you to the ground if you do not go home and rest now. It is not a law that you must finish your tenure alive. Why didn't you rest within uh, with them, those your colleagues that you talked about? Greed didn't allow you rest. You use your old age to take rest and peace from Nigeria. But you had ignored Obasanjo's advice in 2019 that you should take a rest. Baba, hand over to your VP and go and rest at home. Your colleagues are resting, but one dementia that is even older than you is causing noise and air pollution because of his interest. But we believe the scripture that says affliction shall not rise the second time again. Affliction will not rise again. But Nabdekano said you once rested in the Lord. Why are you still wanting, why are you still wanting to rest again? You jostle for this position with all desperation, threatening fire and brimstone. If you don't emerge as winner, now you are complaining and shifting the blame for your failure to hold age. <laughs> then go home and rest. Who they force you? Go and rest. In fact, you can leave now. And Tinubu Asiku are still the age of 35 years, aspiring to be the president that his mate Buhari is running out and complaining it now. Why not Adebanjo or Amechi contest too? <clears throat> okay, yeah. So this Ubali Ubazili K Amechi, they are in their nineties. Then resign so that you have enough time to rest. It's a lie. Continuity in twenty twenty three. It is a lie. If he's given another chance, he will contest. Resign then if it is by force to continue, or is it by force to continue your tenure? 90 years old man, you will not you will rot in jail. Come 2023, the honor of old age is that that it knows that vanity is vanity. Honor your age, resign as quickly as possible. So, guys, let's hear your opinion. Do you really buy this statement coming out from Buhari? Leave your comment down there below and let us have your take.